Taconda de Fracatose, Sipara da Bala Pacosa, a Cade de Bedu Satelica, Sina da Baba Baba Conde de Bradaba, a Papa Baba Conde de Betabe, O Parabaca, Donde de Betesse. Let it rain, pour your rain, let it fall on earth, cause we're in your presence, let it rain, pour your rain, let it fall on earth, not hoping the flood came in upon them. Cause your rain to fall on us. Open the floodgate in abundance. And cause your rain to fall on us. By power. Oh, by power. Through the blood, through the blood of 
the Lamb, of the Lamb, of the Lamb. Oh, I enter to worship you only, only through God. I enter to honor I am, honor the great I am. Oh, I enter to worship you only, only you, only you. Oruko, Oruko, Oruko. 
It's a brown new morning anywhere you are. Just go ahead and worship them. Jesus, Jesus, that's more than enough. If all I say is Jesus, Jesus, I say Jesus, that's more than enough. If all I say is Jesus, haha, Jesus, haha, Jesus, haha, there's more than enough. Let every other name fade away. Yes. Let every other name fade away. Cancer, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Let every other name yes. fade away. Away, yes. barrenness, stagnancy. Hey, hey, let her every other name fade away. Limitation, stagnancy. Let every other name fade away. Disappointment, they can't have a ghost. Let every other name fade away. See, there's only you. See, there's only you. Hallelujah. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Next Level Prayers this morning. If you're familiar with our church, you know that the recording is taking place from our church. We just, and it's just wonderful. This morning, we're going to share some testimonies with you, and we're going to go straight into prayers. We're going to go straight into prayers. We're going to share some testimonies with you and go straight into prayers. Glory to God. I hope you're ready. I hope you're ready to pray. I hope you're ready to be blessed. I know and be transformed glory to God I say glory to God hallelujah, hallelujah. you know I, I want to start with the testimony I read or I, I think I'm not sure if I read it on Friday or maybe someone else read it and this is a testimony from a lady he says good morning pastor Bolaji I will not be ungrateful to God if I do not share this testimony Pastor, for looking from our pregnancy class those that could not have a child how many people do you know that I've gotten pregnant right now about three of them. There's a class of people that have been trying to have children, some of them five years, yes, 10 years, many years, many years. 15 yeah. years. Now three of them are actually, you know, actually now pregnant. Praise the Lord. You know, and, th and that's the one we know because after the course, we discontinue the class. So they have to, and if you are there and you're participating in the prayer, maybe you have to get back and, you know, participate in that. So this lady said, I will not be ungrateful to God if I do not share this testimony. I was diagnosed with PCOS in October 2019. It is an hormonal imbalance that causes infertility in a lot of women. It's, it's a major thing amongst women. But think about the song we just said. Let every Hallelujah. other name Thank fade you. away. Hallelujah. PCOS has to bow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, as I'm reading this, I remember a testimony I got from one of our brothers and this has to do with a lady in Kenya and the lady had had cancer for a long time she said the rate of my recovery is amazing the doctor this is cancer he said the rate of my recovery is amazing that it's, it's, it's surprising the doctors so she said I've been on several drugs and this year it has been a roller coaster for me in August 2020 she's been on several drugs of the PCOS my doctors advised me to go for an HSG test to check if my fallopian tubes were okay so that we'll know exactly what we're dealing with he said i did the test and she said voila Hallelujah. <laughs> he said voila Hallelujah. <laughs> when she did the test i want to notice this this was in august he says my two tubes were blocked ah, Hallelujah. my Thank two tubes Jesus. were blocked hey. she said i cried I, I love the way she said it he said i cried hey, with emphasis <laughs> he said 
thankfully I was not alone so, thankfully I was alone so I had enough space and time to cry out my lungs while I was crying the Holy Spirit told me to stand up and start dancing and giving thanks Hallelujah. then the doctor began to talk about IVF option he said and so I was you know I was rejecting the result I was making inquiries about IVF he said I went into depression and I was barely existing during the November fasting and praying and remember that our December fasting and praying it's first second and third he said pastor Bingham prophesied during the prayers he said your tubes are opened Hallelujah. he said I screamed and said amen. amen he said the way I screamed my husband rushed in thinking something was wrong I told him I told him babe my tube has Hallelujah. been hopeful thank you Jesus you Hallelujah. must learn how to receive thank the word you, you must learn Hallelujah. how to receive the word Hallelujah. He said, I called my doctor and he told me to go for another HSD test. He said, Pastor Bolaji, I went for another test last week Friday. My result came in yesterday. My tubes were open. I have patent tubes. Praise the Lord. I have perfect fallopian tube. Nothing is wrong with my tubes again. God did it. He said, not one tube, the two tubes are now perfect. Somebody say, hallelujah. He said, my next Thank testimony you, is the fact that I'm now pregnant. Thank Praise God. Thank you, Glory to God. Thank you, Glory to God. Amen. Pastor, would you read one of the testimonies you yes, have? Pastor, this is also the testimony of uh, a healing for someone. She says, good morning, Pastor. Yes. I'm of the habit of not sharing testimony, but I'm trying to change that. Mm. She said, my period lasted for over a month. Wow. For over a month. And I got very worried. However, I didn't want to go to the hospital because I was scared. I was wow. scared to hear wow. reports like endometriosis or fibroid. Hmm. Wow. I joined last week Thursday through hmm. a friend and I've been joining since. Yes. By Friday, the bleeding stopped Hallelujah. completely. Hallelujah. 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 She said Hallelujah. the bleeding stopped yeah. complete. Yeah. Bleeding for one month. Hallelujah. She joined the service on Thursday Hallelujah. within 24 hours. You know why I'm saying this? Because oh, within see, 24 yeah. hours, some of you will have instant miracle Amen. manifestation. Amen. Hallelujah. In Amen. A, yes. Hallelujah. Yes, Pastor, Hallelujah. I want to read the testimony. Someone said, good morning, Pastor. I want to thank God for healing in my left ear. I kid into the testimony Pastor Bolaji read this morning about somebody with an injured right ear that God healed. I've been praying to God for my healing because I've never heard from that ear. Hold on. Hallelujah. This person has never heard from one ear. Yes. He said, but while I was praying, while praying, I was hearing sound. Yes. And though I could not hear clearly, I want to give thanks to God because I know he will perfect it. I'm in my early 30s and I have never heard my from God. it ever since I was able my to do that hearing. He's Hallelujah. in his early 30s. He has never heard from Hallelujah. the ear. As soon as I said praying, he said, I began to hear sounds. Hallelujah. And you know what I'm saying? This is important. So I said, when it's perfected, listen to me, but grateful. The reason why sometimes some testimonies are instant, mm. some testimonies are progressive. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. This morning that we're going to just go ahead and thank God and praise God and honor His holy name. Let's go ahead and thank Him. Let's go ahead and lead us in prayer. Let's go ahead and thank Him. 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 Oh, glory, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you. Father, in the name of Jesus, we love you. Father, we appreciate you. We appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for answer prayers. Thank you because you are good. Thank you because your mercies endure forever. Thank you for not putting us to shame. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. We're going to pray this morning, and this is a prayer point. What's a prayer point? 
as people come to the end of the year people begin to faint people get overwhelmed tired but the bible said they that wait upon the lord they shall renew their strength Hallelujah. they shall this mount the up with wings God. as Hallelujah. eagle they shall mount up with wings as eagle we're going to pray pastor is going to lead us in this prayer what's the prayer i refuse to faint i refuse to give up on the things i want god to do in 2020 my strength is renewed my strength is divine in the name of jesus christ let's go ahead and pray in the name of jesus christ oh glory to god Yes, 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 I refuse to give up. I told her, I refuse to give up. I hold on. I hold on. I hold on, I hold on to the word of God. I believe it shall be here as it was told me. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. What God has said to you, in the name of Jesus Christ, what God has said to you, it manifests. You will end the in Jesus' name we pray. Hallelujah. Say what we say in the name of Jesus Christ. I refuse to cave in. I refuse to give up. Everything God has for me in 2020. I lay hold of it. There is no carryover. There is no carryover. There is no carryover. 2020. As God has said to me about this year, I declare, I receive everything before December 31st. In the name of Jesus, go ahead and pray in the name of Jesus. I declare no carryover. I declare no carryover. I declare no carryover. In Jesus' name we pray. Hallelujah. You're going to pray for yourself. And this prayer is touched, is attached to your spiritual life. Jesus told Peter, he said, Peter, Peter, the devil wants to have you. He said, the devil wants to have you and sift you as a whip. He said, boy, I prayed for you. This morning, you are going to pray. The devil will not have me. The flesh will not have me. The devil will not have my prayer life. The devil will not have my finance. He will not have my children. He will not have my home. Go ahead and lead the prayer. Pastor Lee. The devil will not have me. The flesh will not have me. The In Jesus' name we pray. Hey, stretch forth your hands towards me. Jesus prayed for Peter. He said, devil desires to have you. There are some of you, uh, where you are, devil desires to have your health. Uh, devil desires to have your job. He desires to have your prayer life. Uh, but I stand I on your behalf. Uh, I lift up the sword of the Lord. Anywhere the devil wants to have you, uh, I said you have escaped. He's here by your children. He's here by your job. He's here by your home. I stand on the finished walk of Calvary. Anywhere Satan wants to have you, in the name of Jesus Christ, his mission is aborted. 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 Over your life, over your health, over your children, over your career, in the name of Jesus. 
Jesus. Hey, He said, The plan I have for you is plan of good, not of evil, to bring you to an expected end in 2020. Before this year is over, but God take a part in the The plan of God will find full expression in your lives. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name we pray. Hey, uh, hey. We're going to sing a song together. And this song, I've been singing it since yesterday during service. What is the song? All of that God. They are the works of men. You are the only God. There is no like you. Hold on, hold on. I want to explain the song to you. Some people believe that my uncle is powerful. So they think they will have a testimony because of that. Some people think if I join Illuminati, if I join um, if I join um, Freemason, if I belong to a bunny, if I see do money ritual, something will happen. They say that our God is slow. That's not our God. The Bible says our God is a consuming fire. That's what the Bible says. He said, while you are yet asking, I will do it. We are declaring. Whatever they think cannot be done. All other gods are the work of men. They say you can't have the baby. They are not God. They say you can't get a promotion. They are not God. They say you can't get healed. They are not God. They say you can't get a promotion. They are not God. All other works are the works of men. You are the only God. Are you ready? Yes. Let's go ahead and sing it together. Because hey, all, all of that them, God, hey, hey, they are the works of men. You are the only God. You, you are, are the, the only God. God. There is no like you. There is no like you. All of the gods, all of the gods, they are the works of men. They are the works of men. You are the only God. You are, you are the, the only God. God. There is no like you. There, there is no like all of the gods. All of the gods. They are the only They are the works of man. You are. You are, you are the, the only God. God. There is no like you. There is no like you. This is your prayer point. Lord, show your power in my life. Show your glory in my life. He says, the voice came from heaven. He said, I will glorify you. Ah, before 2020 is over, in my household, let there be significant testimonies. Let there be significant testimonies. Let there be significant testimonies. Let there be, be, be proof that I serve a living God. Anywhere you want, go ahead and pray. Manikete juge le balota, eba kute, eba kute, eba kute. Skomen ke brodo konzo de bata. Let my life be God. Ye poshala ne te kaba, ye poshala ne kaba tola, ye kara tola, sale kara tola, ila kara sile baba katola ma. E brake te juge le brake te la rada baska. Hakere bashata. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. In a very symbolic way, you're gonna put your hands over your stomach yeah. everything that is delayed for 2020 i really i bet it now huh? in the realm of the spirit you need to bet your husband you need to bet your increase you need to bet your child you need to bet your healing the bible says as soon as zion travel she get better that's the local leaders in prayer we are going to bet it I translate. Oh, Sile Pada Catala Ramara. As soon as I am Kabea, I'm betting houses, I'm betting promotion, I'm betting souls, I'm betting expansion, I'm betting business funding, I'm betting breakthroughs in the name of Jesus Christ. Ah, 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, Mato Boro de Bahia. 
with your hands on your stomach as you have conceived it that word from God as you have conceived it what the Lord has spoken to you I come as a prophet I said let you receive, receive it Amen. I said receive it Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ 2020 is going nowhere until there's manifestation for you I declare and align my words with the word of Apostle Paul I believe it shall be as it was told Thank you, you in the name of Jesus Christ Amen. I call for promotions Amen. I call for funding I call for healings Amen. I call for babies Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. everyone with their hands on your belly receive your portion I said 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 receive your portion the barrier is broken I said the barrier is broken I said the barrier is broken in the name of Jesus oh glory to God we're going to read one more scripture first corinthians chapter 16. verse 9. what does he say he said i said before you a great and effectual door he said this door is great god says i said before you a great and effectual door but see what the apostle said he said there are many adversaries so there are doors that have been set but there are barriers they are limits God opens a door for you in business, but there's a barrier that you face, you can't press on. God opens a door for you in your job, in your career, but the sound is, is a limit. God opens a door and there's this different kind of barrier. He said there are many adversaries, but it doesn't matter if the adversaries or not. The name of Jesus is beyond them. Let me tell you how the Bible deals with adversary. Isaiah chapter 58. Oh, glory to God. Hey, Paul, run the yeah, yeah, Matala How does God deal with adversaries? Isaiah 45, rather. Verse 2. Hey, what does he say? He says, I will go before thee and make the crooked way straight. How does God deal with adversaries? Some of you, there's a door opportunity for you, but there's so many barriers. God is saying to you today, He said, I will go before you and make the crooked way straight. This is what he said. He said, I will break in pieces the gates of brass. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He says, what are the gates of brass? Gates of brass are limits. Tough limits. God says, I will break it. I don't know the limits you are facing. When it comes to your job, when it comes to your marriage, when it comes to your business. He says, I will cut asunder the bars of lion of iron. He says, I will cut asunder the bars of lion. What is your prayer today? Every adversary that is hinging my open door in the name of Jesus Christ. Say we me, say in the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. Every adversary contending for my open door in the name of Jesus. Take your leave. Lose your hold. Take your leave. Lose your hold. Take your leave. Lose your grip. In the name of Jesus. Go ahead and pray anyway. We're still praying. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. La poro ketea. Le ketele ro de bokosha. E la mataya. E to koshe da. This is a very powerful prayer point. Holy Spirit. Say with me, say Holy Spirit. 
attend to every self and background imposed barrier. Ah, Holy Ghost. Sometimes the barrier is not on the outside, the barrier is on the inside. Jesus spoke to two disciples for several hours. They were hearing him, but they could not understand until he opened their understanding. What is a prayer? Holy Spirit, please attend to every self and barry and background imposed barrier and cause them to be displaced. There are some barriers that is from self. There are some barriers that is from background. What are you asking? Holy Spirit, do your work. 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 Attend to it. Attend to it. Attend to it. If it needs to be burnt up, let it be burnt up. If there needs to be illumination, let it be illumination. Let's go ahead and pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Just two more prayer points. Hey, you are going to declare. I want us to move back because I want to do something prophetic. Thank you, Jesus. If you can get some space, because I want to do something prophetic. Hallelujah. Anywhere you are, as you say this word, take two steps forward and start praying. By faith, hallelujah. by the power of the hallelujah. Holy Ghost, hallelujah. I step into my new level. Step into my yes, new level. Step, hallelujah. hallelujah. Let Once you do that, that, let me do it again. Let's, that, let's go back and show them. Just pay attention. Mm. Don't pray yet. Anywhere you are, take two steps forward. Hallelujah. And say, as you're taking it, say by faith, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I step into my new level. And you can be specific. Mm. I step into my next level financially. I step into a next level in my marital life. I step into a next level in my career. Mm. We're going to do it right now. It's just a step of faith. Mm. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Anywhere you are, just position Hallelujah. yourself. Position yourself. Hallelujah. And as you step into it, mm. don't just step physically. Mm. In your mind, step into it. Hallelujah. In your mind. Many of you do things. Some of you, you are praying to be married. As you step into it, see yourself in your husband's wife, house. See your wife in your house. See your business operating in the things of billions. See the barrier has been destroyed. Are you ready? In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare today, I step by faith into my new level. In the name of Jesus Christ, I step into my next level. I step into it. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I step into it. Atora, Matela, Aparo, Sidene, Menados, Sidemente, Helemotolaboshi, Hela, Atora, Matora, 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 Matara, Yetan, Remonte, Remonega, La Batia, Sacatelabosisa, Yetan, Remonosisa, San Batea, 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 Hey, Bataya. In Jesus' name, we pray. Please, let's go back again. One more time. Hallelujah. Praise God. We are going to step forward again. By faith. I step into my testimonies. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. By faith, I step into my testimonies. You are praying for a lot of things. Thank you. But today, being Monday, I step into my testimony. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Take two steps forward. One, two. By faith, I step into my testimonies. Into my testimony. Go ahead and pray. I step into my healing. I step into my healing. I step into my healing. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. I, you know, I have just an instruction. We are going to read more testimonies. And that's really testimonies. God said, we'll read one as you used to prophesy. Hallelujah. Please, everyone that needs a testimony, gather now. Mm. <laughs> We're going to read testimony. We can, we, will, we can read what I've read before. It doesn't matter. Mm. The point that every testimony is becoming prophetic. Amen. What's prophetic? Every testimony is a, now a picture of what God will do in your life. Hallelujah. Amen. I say hallelujah. hallelujah. I say hallelujah. hallelujah. 
I don't know where I will start from. Will you start from your testimony? Any pastor, testimony at all? Pastor, you could have read it before. It doesn't matter. Pastor, this person said yes. that his Australian student visa has been stalled since July due it, to COVID-19 issues. His visa has been it's stalled stalled. since July. Yes. yes. He said at the end of the monthly fasting and prayer for November, I wrote down my prayer request and stated that I want the Australian government to commence the visa application uh -huh. before the next 14 working days. Uh -huh. On 17th of November, yes. during the morning prayers, you, pastor read the testimony of someone whose brother has not seen his two-year son because of immigration visa issues and has finally received the visa approval. At I, I keyed into the testimony immediately. Mm -hmm. Pastor <coughs> B also prayed for the power of delays to be broken, which I also keyed into. Amen. Lo and behold, Hallelujah. one hour. One hour. One hour after what? the morning prayer. Hey, I, 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 I received a call from my agent that the Australian That's a power of God. That's a power of God. Everyone that's delayed received immigration papers. You have problems with it. Any form of delay, just as the power of God came through for this man. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive your testimony. I said, receive your testimony. The power of delay is broken. The immigration thing are sorted in your favor Amen. in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus I told Amasa the caution yes 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 someone said good morning Pastor Balaji thank you so much for this morning prayers and yes. indeed my prayers have been answered yes. God did it he said I was invited to the prayer to this morning prayer by my junior brother yes I've been believing God for an international job on the island among other prayer you've requests. been believing for an international job yes sir uh -huh. he said uh, as I no longer get job satisfaction in my present place of work uh -huh. and too much politics are involved he, he said today i received a call from a client who just took interest in my career growth i mm. wanted to help me advance yeah. with a better job nothing has been finalized yet but i'm thanking god for the call as it is the beginning of greater hallelujah. things hallelujah. and hallelujah. i know that i will testify before hallelujah. this year runs out of my employment hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen. everyone that help is needed Amen for your next level Amen. the same way someone took interest in her without even asking the little can the angels of god are dismissed into the four corners of the earth into the universe and they are raising helpers for you receive her receive her in the name of jesus Hallelujah. At all emotions. Please read one more testimony. Yes. And all the next level yes. crew. Yes. Thank you for the amazing work you are doing here. Uh -huh. It says this morning during prayers, uh -huh. Pastor Femi mentioned the case of someone being healed of knee pain. Uh -huh. And I noticed that the pain I had been experiencing on my knee region for some weeks had vanished mm. immediately. I immediately started doing all I could not do in the past weeks. I can now lift my leg without any pain, except on the knee. I can get up easily. I can Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I can cross Thank my legs. Father. I can climb the stairs hey. without hey. 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 Anyone that has any kind of pain, either his knee, his ankle, his neck, any kind of sickness, if you will stretch forth your hands towards me power will flow sir in the name that is above every other name i come against every spirit of infirmity i come against every spirit of pain every spirit of blindness deafness tumors in the name of jesus christ of nazareth i come to come out of their bodies i come to come out of their chest come out of their heart in the name of the be healed i said be healed i said be healed pain go away eyes be healed ears be healed heart condition be healed. Amen. Tumors disappear. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Right now. The power of God touches you anywhere you are. Amen. I told him us. Healing is taking place right now. Thank you, Conditions. Someone has a heart problem. Mm. You listen to me. You are healed right now. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, we'll take the last one. Hallelujah. This one I've read before. Yes, I want sir. to read it again. He said, good morning, Pastor B. I will only be ungrateful to God if I do not share this great testimony. Uh -huh. I was diagnosed with PCOS in October 2019. It is a hormonal imbalance that causes infertility in a lot of women. Uh -huh. I've been on several drugs, and this year has just been a roller coaster. So this me. causes infertility yes, in women. a lot of women. Yes. The reason why I'm saying so is that if your case is infertility, mm. your case has to mention. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So you need to be getting Thank ready you, now. Father. You Thank need to be getting Father. ready now. Amen. Yes. He said, in August 2020, my doctor advised me to go for a HSD check, G test to check if my fallopian tubes were okay so we know exactly what we are dealing with. She said, I did the test and voila, 
my two tubes were blocked if your two tubes are blocked congratulations hallelujah because the lord has thank remembered you, you. Thank if you, your Father. womb is too weak to carry a baby hey! if your sperm is not to have a baby hallelujah. whatever it is congratulations amen. because the same god that did this amen. is visiting you now amen, amen. Hallelujah. what happened sir? she said i cried thankfully i was alone so i had the space and time to cry my lungs out but while i was crying the Holy Spirit told me to stand up hey, and start Rana. dancing and give thanks. No How does a sad person cry, dance and give thanks at the same time? But I did. And then he told me to reject the result. But somewhere in my mind, the devil was telling me to get ready for IVF. So while I was rejecting the results, I was making inquiries about IVF. She said I went into depression afterwards and I was barely existing. During the November fasting and prayer day one, Pastor Benga prophesied and said, your tubes are open. Ah. I screamed and said, amen. My husband rushed in thinking something was wrong. And I told him, babe, my tubes are opened. I called my doctor and he told me to go for another HSG test. Uh, Pastor B, I went for the test last week Friday and I have perfect fallopian tubes. Uh, nothing is wrong with my tubes. God did it. Hallelujah. Not one tube, but two tubes. Not oh. one tube, two tubes. Hey, <laughs> Melito Paradia. Someone says, how can prayer affect tubes? The tubes were made by words. Mm -hmm. How did God make man? Mm. Through words. Hallelujah. Amen. It spoke man to be. The spirit came out of words and his body came out of dust. If the, it says, he sent his word and his word healed their Hallelujah. diseases. Hallelujah. Are you ready? In the name of Hallelujah. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, lay a quartes on pater, meno parosis ito ketosha, Zile pari into keman pononomes. Whatever has stayed within you and having a child, in the name of Jesus Christ, that sickness, that limitation, is dismantled today. In the name of Jesus, I declare: everyone that has blocked fallopian tube, everyone that has PCOS, everyone that the womb cannot carry a child, is finding difficult to have a child by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the next 30 days, return with you being Amen. pregnant. Return with you being pregnant. Amen. Return with you being Amen. pregnant. Fallopian tubes are open right Amen. now. PCOS, go away, Jesus. Amen. Irregular menstrual cycle. Oh, mona imbalance. I rebuke you. I command you, leave. In the Amen. name of Jesus, Satania, Satania, Satania Palita, and Likuteneno Barua Mata. Every man that's not been able to get his wife pregnant, Shile Katana, the same grace rests upon you right now. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Aporodosia. Everyone that has a negative medical report, I stand as a prophet of God. I rewrite another report that is positive. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. We worship and praise Thank your holy you, name. We worship and praise Thank your holy name. You, we worship and praise your holy name. Hallelujah. 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 I say 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 hallelujah. hallelujah. Ah, God has done Thank it. God has Jesus. done it. God has done it. God has Thank done it. Anywhere you are, rejoice. God has done it. Anywhere you are, rejoice. God has done it. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Amen. Hey, praise God. Hallelujah. Hey, tomorrow, our focus on prayer is no carryover. No carryover. Hallelujah. This is still our season of deliveries. Thank you, Father. Everything destined for 2020 will release it. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So we are not carrying the new car to next year, the new house to next year. Hey, Patea Katasha, no carryover. Tomorrow will be intense. Amen. Get all your family members to join. Hallelujah. Listen to me. Hallelujah. Get all your family members to join. Amen. If you have a testimony, please send in your testimony. Your testimony, look at today. The testimony became an instrument yes. to bless other people. Yes. Just imagine your testimony was here. People will begin to refer to you. So you are not just blessed. Your testimony itself is a blessing. Oh my God. No matter what it is, send in your testimony yes. today. Yes. Send it in on Facebook, on the email address on the screen, on inbox and Instagram. Send in your testimony because that testimony will multiply in the name of tomorrow. Tomorrow, I want to get all your friends. I want to get all your friends to be there. Remember that Wednesdays are communion service. Extremely, extremely powerful. Hallelujah. Extremely powerful. 
powerful, extremely powerful. Thank you for joining us in time of prayer. Thank you, Pastor Fuluki and Pastor Nee. Thank you for joining us. It's so wonderful. And listen to me. What is the word for today? I'm stepping into my testimony. Let me see you stepping in. I'm stepping into my testimony. I'm stepping into my. Yeah, I'm stepping. Yeah, yeah. It, it's present. See, so as I step into one, I step into another one. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Congratulations and God bless you. In Jesus' name. Amen.